Hey guys, it's me, Delf One, here with Airsoft Talk, and this little contraption here is another use of the master key mount that I'm making. And yes, it's a master key mount, but it can be used for more than just a shotgun undermount. You can use it for all sorts of stupid stuff like this. Now, um, this here is a KJW SIG P226. It's been customized and all that good stuff. SEMA Glock. By the way, sorry if you hear some wind or anything in the background. It's uh, really windy. I'm actually going to move my camera real quick so it won't show the wind. Hopefully I'll be in frame, but uh, this is just a really funny looking contraption, and yes, this is going to be a Cuz I Can video sound amplifier, but it's just the many uses of what uh, a rail can do in my uh, little universal mount where you can mount a barret to another barret, or you can just mount a saw to a saw. I mean, the many uses of my little master key mount, I guess I'll just turn this into a video for this, but it's just, you know, you do stupid stuff. And it's not about being practical. I mean, I get crap because, you know, oh, that's probably too heavy, blah, 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 blah. If I just stick my finger in between that, I could just do wield pistols. It's just going to look stupid. But you can do all sorts of crazy stuff. Now, that's what I like about this, and, you know, that's not practical and all, but I can actually, I'm actually thinking about making a trigger that's mechanical, unfortunately. There's no way I can do a MOSFET. But every time I pull this trigger, it'll fire that and make that shoot. So let me know if I should pursue something like this, because I can do stuff like that, and I would be just be one of those things where you can get two of them and just go, pa 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 pa. Now, I don't know if this will work for gas to gas, but uh, the bottom pistol will have to either be non-blowback and have a rail on top, or it'll have to be an AP of some sort. Or it could even be an assault rifle. But um, let me know if I should do something like that, but mechanical triggers do have a tendency to not work at all or just not want to cooperate with you. So, guys, let me know what you think. It's pretty whack. And I just want to give a quick thanks to uh, good buddy Jolly for letting me do this. And, guys, thanks for watching.